We begin with breaking news. A fire burning along I-80 in Parley's Canyon is forcing evacuations tonight. The Parley's fire broke out just a few hours ago. This fire also led to a major road closure. Fox 13's Haley Higgins is there now live. Haley, tell us what road is closed and what are the conditions like right now? Yeah, well, it's a really uh, significant road closure. I-80 is closed in both directions in Parley's Canyon uh, to get from Salt Lake to uh, to Park City. Now, that is closed. So you'll need an alternate route for that. Now, the good news is, as you said, Kelly, uh, our conditions have calmed down. But earlier today, the wind caused this fire to grow to about 200 acres very quickly. Now, the fire moved in dry, dense vegetation. Firefighters say the strong winds fed this fire, allowing it to grow very rapidly. Now the Mount Air community, that's where we're at right now, is made up of about 500 lots, mostly cabins. They are evacuated tonight. We're told likely through the night that evacuation will continue until the fire is no longer a threat. Now property owners tell me that what is difficult about this community, it, it is in a box canyon, meaning that there is only one way in, only one way out, and if the fire was to block the road, the only other way people could get out is to hike through the mountains. It's just coming home. I had about 10 phone calls saying there's a fire. It's nerve wracking, but this is something we've prepared for for many, many years and been concerned about. Now, the wind has died down quite a bit, but we're told that the wind did push the fire north away from this community here. Now, we do have some good news. One, we haven't heard of any buildings that caught fire during this uh, situation here. We've also seen many animal reunions, which have been heartfelt uh, for people who were evacuated. They weren't allowed to get to their homes. Meanwhile, their neighbors saw the animals, went inside, took their took their uh, neighbor's animals and were able to bring them out. So that's some good news here. We are expecting things to quiet down now that the wind has calmed, uh, but this is a very still a tense situation with airdrops as crews try to contain this fire. Again, last count, 200 acres. Reporting live at Parley's Canyon, Haley Higgins, Fox 13 News, Utah. Haley, before we let you go, can you give us some idea as to the activity of the crews at this point? Have they stopped for the night? Is air, mm -hmm. are air operations still ongoing? Yeah, air operations are still ongoing. The crews are still very uh, concentrated. You can see a little bit behind me. I know it is dark and we are on this private drive here, uh, but crews are working and I'm told they'll work through the night uh, to do what they can to get the upper hand on this fire, Bob. And Haley, this is a very busy stretch of I-80 going up Parley's Canyon and coming down. Any word on when the road will reopen? No word on that, and that is a really big inconvenience for a lot of people here who need to uh, travel I-80. Their only other options is to go either Weber or Provo Canyons, uh, so a big uh, detour for folks who need to get around this area. But again, it's for the safety of people, especially uh, as they're doing the airdrops and gives firefighters plenty of room to do their job. Yeah, Haley? certainly a long detour, but really the only option tonight mm. with this ongoing fire. Haley Higgins live there along I-80 I right near the Parley's fire. We'll check in with you again, Haley, if anything big happens. Thank you.